can't find it, Dad. And I, I can't just, find I, it, Dad. We talk about those people that can take the, the time off. Everyone's a little bit different. I can't find what? The toothpaste. Uh oh. Well, let's look for it. We're having a, a crisis in the Freeborn house that hold this morning. We can't find Cal's toothpaste. Other than that, we've been up since like five o'clock when both boys got up. It's nine o'clock now. Everyone sort of has kind of a stuffy nose. So we're just chilling, drinking some coffee, hanging out, trying to figure out what we are gonna do with our Saturday. Um, you, your toothpaste fell down? Yeah, I did. Do you think it's on the ground in the bathroom then, maybe? I can find it. You, okay, I'll go look. Well, it's not in the bathroom, bud. Okay, I'll look out here. It's, it's kind of a scary thought, though. A missing tube of kids' toothpaste just in your house somewhere. With no cap on it. Could be very bad. Tyler, do you know what happened to the toothpaste? Oh, okay. Why is he vlogging? I, I don't think he's going to be much help. We keep looking, Dad. What? We keep looking. All right, let's keep looking. Thanks for your help, Kyler. All come out all in the streets and like to play. All dressed up in costumes and all shapes in every size. What's wrong, bud? You don't like Booby Howie no more? My mom. How did you get there? What's going on out here? I'm batting the wall. You're batting it? Whoa! I'm Yeah, good job. Yeah! Whoa, good job, Cap. <laughs> that setup actually looks like one bad thing waiting to happen. Cal hitting Kyler in the face with the ball. Nice, Cal. Got a pretty good swing. Pretty good hand eye coordination there. You saw doggy poop over there? <laughs> yeah. Okay. A lot of doggy poop? Yeah. You gotta be careful not step in it. Yeah. And it pooped that way. Oh yeah? Yeah. Oh, he's running away with your ball. <laughs> yeah, be nice, bud. No, you can play with it, bud. Just be nice. Don't be so mean. It's so funny, the boys have like, like intervals. It's basically lots of play, lots of activity, then rest, like they were just sitting on the couch, just hanging out, and then lots of activity again. Now we're back outside to play more. Uh, it's just, it's funny how it ebbs and flows. They get tired, then they rest, and they get tired, then they rest. I know this is hard, but I need to ask you some questions about what happened. Boys are in bed. Uh, I'm going to work out now. My nose is still stuffy. And it's unbelievably, it's unbelievable how annoying having one nostril clog and one open can be. It just makes your tolerance for everything so small. You're so irritated, so annoyed. <sighs> Anyways, I'm gonna work out. Before we get <sighs> China and the United States have negotiated a very complicated contract. Well, they each got the right to cancel it and put it on the bid. So, by canceling that contract, it gives us the, um, the legal right to be clear. Workout's over. 
sounds like one of the boys are up too. And while it was a really great workout, I wasn't really able to fe shake this feeling of frustration that I have. I don't know. I just sometimes I sometimes I think people get a feeling of anxiety or depression or they just get in a funk and for me I never really feel that way I just sometimes feel just generally frustrated and when I get like that it's even more frustrating because I can't quite put my finger on what it is I'm frustrated and worked up about um, sometimes workouts help sometimes they don't but this one didn't and I don't know I don't know if it's a frustration uh, where my life is or not we're frustrated I'm not where I want to be or because those feelings don't come readily to the top but it's just this uh, like I could just take off running as hard as I possibly could and just run for as long as I could possibly stand it that's that's the that's the sensation that that's how the sensation I feel would like manifest itself if I could put it into some kind of physical tangible thing that's what it would look like just chasing it I don't know I don't know if I'm making any sense here but workouts over I think I'm gonna run a quick errand real quick and get some Claritin D for this nose and maybe the frustration will will subside well you didn't sleep long Sounds like it was really exciting. So we're, we we really are on our way to get medicine, which does involve getting on the highway because where I live, uh, there's such a problem with people using anything that has Sudafed in it to make uh, other illicit drugs that in my immediate town, Joplin, you can't buy Sudafed over the counter or even behind the counter, you need a prescription. So uh, you've got to drive to one of the neighboring communities, which isn't too far, it's you know 20 minutes or whatever, but uh, you've got to drive 20 minutes to buy Claritin D. So that's what we're doing. We're headed to uh, Carthage Walmart, no, Carthage Walgreens, to get some Claritin D. Let's go. Store. I might get this stroller out. Okay. A lot of work to go to Walgreens and get some Claritin. <laughs> we got the Claritin D, but obviously we can't come to a store without finding the toys as well. Toys. Which one? You don't want this right here? No, you don't want it? Okay. Over here? Alright. Mom, that! Where's your baby shark? Alright. Cal got a transformer car, and Kyler got a baby shark. He really likes that baby shark song. But we got the Claritin D, so mission success. Time to go back home. We made it back with our medicine and our new toys and also some ice cream for Kelsey. No. That's pretty cool, huh? That's an unreal baby shark song. Yeah. Oh. Echo, play baby shark. That's the same song that's in there. Yeah. It's called Baby Shark Songs. I like it. It's because 